Elspeth, who doesn't love a swing training aid? So we're going to review this, and I guarantee you're going to want to buy one. And the best news is I'm going to save you 10% with the link below. So what is this gadget? It's called the swing plate. And what does it do? It does multiple of things, but it's really good for me teaching to get people into the right positions and to stop them uh, reproducing their faults and get them moving correct. So there's multiple ways you can use it. The number one benefit for me is that it's portable. It fits in your golf bag. You can use it when you practice. And like anybody that practices up the range, you know you can't stick a, a stick in the ground. But this is where this comes in. You can stick the stick into here. And because it's got a flat base, you can use it on concrete, uh, on the range, or you can just move it about on the grass quite easily. So what does it do for you as the golfer? Uh, for me, the number one thing it does is it helps you swing plane. So you quite often see people taking it inside or too far outside. So you can position the sticks, uh, as I'll show you, uh, later in the video to help you improve that. It also helps stop sway um, and hip slide and increase rotation. It also helps weight transfer and multiple other things including helping your head position, keeping your head still during the swing. Okay so it's really easy to set up and you can position it round yourself however you want to improve whatever aspect of your game you're working on. So all I've done is put the li alignment stick into the base and from there in this position you can work on weight transfer making sure you're moving towards the stick you can also stop the hip slide and increase rotation with this one should we give it a go so then if we pick the base up and swap it round and we put it on the trail side this one for me is a really good drill where you set up with it right next to your right leg, obviously for a right-handed golfer. And from there, it's gonna stop the sway off the ball. So if you've got it close enough and you're hitting the shot and you sway a lot, you're gonna kind of move into the stick and it's gonna stop you from moving and stay centered. Okay, so I hear you saying, well, I don't struggle with swaying off or sliding in. How else can I use it? Well, this is a really good drill you can do to keep your golf swing on the line, especially in the takeaway, and keep it on plane. So when you set up, I want to set this roughly matching your shaft plane. And I see this a lot in golfers where they take it back and it goes inside. So as you can see, if you take it back and go inside, you're gonna hit the stick. So it's gonna help you train to take the club back on line. Again, the opposite way, if you move it outside the ball, and you're somebody that's used to kind of coming over the top, you can position that in a way that's going to help you move underneath and from the inside. So using the swing plate, um, it can also help you stop your slice and turn it into a draw if you know how to position it right. So you can put one, depends how many you've got. But for me, a good drill I like to do to stop slices from slicing the ball and coming over the top. You'll see if I've got this out in front here and I come over the top and across, I'm going to hit the stick. So as long as I'm moving down and I'm coming from the inside and swinging up and out, that's going to turn the slice into a draw just by using that training aid and hitting the ball. So the swing plate, really easy to use, portable device that's gonna help you improve most things wrong in your golf swing. So I use this a lot for coaching. If you're serious about improving your game, it's worth checking out. We've got 10% discount in the comments below.